guys and welcome back to my channel. Today I'm sending a letter back to Anna from Canada. So if you're watching Anna, please turn off now if you want this letter to be a surprise. So Anna sent me these really cute stickers she made herself and on her business card it says that she loves all things spooky. So since Halloween is just around the corner, I thought it'd be a great idea to do a Halloween kind of slash autumnal themed letter. So I chose pictures that had a more autumnal feeling rather than spooky Halloween prints just because it kind of works better with my aesthetic. I also wanted to mention that in Australia it's spring so it kind of feels a little bit odd to be doing an autumnal themed letter when it's spring out. The first pen pal DIY I'm going to make is this little movie favourites card. Again I've used an autumnal picture and I've chosen this black paper so it kind of sticks in with the Halloween theme. Because Halloween isn't a traditional Australian festival, as a kid trick-or-treating didn't really exist and I lived on a farm which was quite rural so it wasn't really possible for me to go trick-or-treating. Um, it's kind of got more popular more into my adult years. I've noticed that more of the big supermarkets have brought out candy and a lot more kids are dressing up and more roaming around the streets. So when I was younger I remember hiring out movies and having movie marathons around Halloween time. Um, this is when there was actually movie shops around and they still existed every town. Um, you don't really see many movie shops around these days, but I used to love going to the movie shops and picking out movies for my weekend. Every Halloween I would re-watch Hocus Pocus and I loved that movie so much, it was one of my favourites. Another one of my favourites was Practical Magic and I had to add in Kiki's Delivery Service because I'm obsessed with Studio Ghibli collection. I'm also obsessed with Tim Burton films and his films are great to watch around Halloween time just because they're so spooky or they have an underlining Halloween theme. My favourite ones that I added in was Corpse Bride and of course I couldn't miss Nightmare Before Christmas. Speaking about Nightmare Before Christmas, I actually decided to draw a few of the characters and include them in this video. So the next DIY is just this little simple bookmark and I've drawn Jack the Skeleton's face a few times um, fitting into this little bookmark shape. So all I've done is drawn it in pencil, rubbed it out, redrawn it in a darker pen and then I've added this autumnal picture again on the back. Now, if you don't have a pre-made bookmark, you can just simply draw one on some card or some cardboard. I actually have a Jack the Skeleton belly button ring and um, I've had it in there for like seven years. I've had my belly button pierced for so long. So again, on the topic of Tim Burton's Nightmare Before Christmas, I also wanted to draw a few of his iconic characters and um, I wanted to leave them as is. So I've just cut them out and I've put this in this really cute baggie and I've just written on it, um, color me in. So I thought this was just a little cute little package to put together. Um, little drawn pictures that someone else can colour in themselves. Next, I'm just making this little envelope for tea. I found this beautiful teapot that matched in so nicely with the theme I'm going for and my colour palette. And then on the back, I've just decorated with this cute little bunny sticker. So I thought it was so adorable. And tea is also a nice thing to drink around autumn and winter. But let's be honest, I drink it all year round because I love my tea. Now I'm just going to decorate the envelope and somehow my design has kind of gone from more autumn themed to kind of this like woodland themed. Um, I don't know how it kind of happened but I still think it's very cute. Now all I have to do is add in the letter and send it off. So 
So thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you enjoyed this video today and I'll see you guys next week. Bye!